Okay, we're going to go back to an interview that Paula Tutman did with a mom. And to set this up, this mom was near the school and she had uh, let her child stay home, from what we understand. But still, hearing this news, I, I, I think any parent, you don't have to be a parent, any of us can identify with the kind of worry uh, that you will hear in her voice. I'm just so emotional because you never think it's going to happen here. And the kids just are all a big part of this community. And it is, I'm so scared for them. And my daughter is safe, but I don't know if all of her friends are safe. And I don't know if my nieces and nephews are safe. So. But I think they are. I'm getting information. So I think they're doing okay. But these peer, parents are just... And they're going through hell, and I can't even imagine it if they don't know where their kids are. What did Lily tell you? That there was some shots fired, and that she was very scared um, for her friends. My daughter happened to be home today. My daughter happened to be home today, which I feel kind of bad because I said kind of suck it up, but... I can't. I'm just so happy she was home. What brings you here then if your daughter's already home? You're, you're, you said nieces, nephews? Yes. Um, I actually work in this building and I was in a massage because I'm a massage therapist. Um, and I was in a massage when the news came out and I didn't know if my daughter was okay. And I didn't know if my daughter was okay. My daughter happened to be home today, which I feel kind of bad because I said kind of suck it up, but, and I didn't know if my daughter was okay. My daughter happened to be home today, and I didn't know if my daughter was okay. My daughter happened to be home today, and I didn't know if my daughter was okay. And she had uh, let her child stay home, from what we understand. And I didn't know if my daughter was okay. Wow, thank you, lady, for telling us that totally amazing and believable story. There was not a single hole in that story that I could find. God bless this lady, and God bless America. God bless us all. Have a happy 2022. It's what you gotta do. Until next time, this is Jake the Asshoo.